Look at this real mathematic trick. Suppose there is a non-terminating recurring decimal like 27.61 and there is a bar over 61 meaning that 61, 61, 61, 61 it repeats itself. Now note that after decimal everything is repeating. There is no digit which is non-repeating. So in this case take the full number like 2761 and then subtract the number which is before decimal like 27 here subtract 27 and in the denominator since we have two digits which are repeating take 100 if three digits are repeating you have to take 1000 and so on and subtract one from this so you will get the answer as 2734 in the numerator and 99 in the denominator and you can check this actually is the rational form of 27.61 bar Likewise, if you have 138.53 with a bar only over 3, so let, let's rub this off and have a 8 here. So 5, 3 bar, now there is a digit which is not repeating and when that happens, take the complete number 1, 3, 8, 5, 3, subtract all the digits which do not have a bar. So 1, 3, 8, 5 and then in the denominator, since you have 2 digits after decimal, so take 100. And finally, subtract how many digits have a bar over it? One digit. So subtract 10 from this. And therefore, your answer for the question will be 12468 upon 90 that reduces to 4156 upon 30. Now you can pick up the calculators and check how did this trick work. For knowing that concept and to watch the detailed video, watch this link shown here. It is a related video which will be a descriptive type of video to know everything about non-terminating recurring decimals being converted to rational form.